Hi guys, hope you're doing well. Um, I thought I'd hop on here because I haven't been on for a while actually and I've had a, quite a few emails from you guys worried about me. One of you said, have you gone to a better place? <laughs> I take you mean Norfolk, not or depending. Um, I'm still here, uh, had a lot going on at the moment in my life so I haven't had a chance to, to get onto YouTube. Um, and also, um, I will flip the camera around and show you my current garage status. There we go. Got a lot of bikes to look at, but none to ride. But let me flip the camera around and explain to you what's happened. So I can't remember um, if I told you I'd sold both my bikes. I think I did, didn't I? Um, so I sold them to a guy um, called, well, there's this father and son actually, Keith and Richard, and they own a motorbike shop down near Bournemouth called Moores Valley Motorcycles. Go and check them out. Really, really nice guys. Um, I met Richard, I didn't meet, meet Keith, but um, Richard bought both the bikes. Um, his dad, Keith, is currently riding the Classic 350. Um, so I don't know how long he'll keep that, but the Super Meteor they've got up for sale already on uh, their website. So if you're interested in the Super Meteor, they've got some lovely bikes there, so you check them out. It's, it's uh, Moores Valley Motorcycles. So thank you, Richard. Nice to meet you. And thank you, Keith. Um, so the saga about my new bike. My God, I, I, I'm not even going to go into the details, actually, because I will get I'll get a lot of abuse from the way uh, the way I actually did this sale, people won't think that I was super clever. Um, but I had found a bike. It was a lovely bike. I, I won't say what it was because I still might get one of those bikes, not this specific one. Um, but unfortunately, the sale has fallen through. Um, through no fault of mine and no fault of the owner, Lee. Uh, he was a lovely guy and I had every faith he'd had it from new. Um, but the distance was a problem he lives in Wales and I don't so um, it's now not possible so unfortunately I am bikeless still well I've actually had my friend's bike for the last week and I'm getting that back again tomorrow so we'll have a bike but um, my own bike I haven't got yet so keep watching if you want to see what I'm gonna get I'm gonna get two bikes um, because we have put an offer in on a property in North, well not Norfolk, Suffolk, in a place called I. And the only problem is uh, we need to sell our place. And to date, it's been on for nearly two weeks and we've had one person come around. And I kind of think she might have been related to the owner of the estate agents. <laughs> they look very similar. Anyway, um, so we'll have to see. Hopefully we'll get some interest. I know it's not the best time to sell for a lot of reasons, um, but yeah. So guys, that's why I haven't been on here. Um, I hope you guys are doing well. Thanks for all the messages and the emails. Um, and I will be, oh, I'll tell you what I did do. Ooh, I test rode uh, Classic 350 Signals Grey. Absolutely love it. I mean, I know the bike anyway, but it looks amazing. And I had the opportunity to take one out and it was incredible. Um, looks so good. And obviously rides like Charlie and Ernie did. Um, I haven't ridden the classic bullet, uh, the bullet 350 yet. And the reason I haven't bought a Signals classic 350 is because I really want to look at the bullet um, before I make my mind up. But I will definitely get one of the two as one of the bikes. So guys, I hope you're doing well, as I said, and I will definitely do a video next week, hopefully with a bike in my garage. Have a great week, guys, and ride safe.